Senator John Cornyn and three other members of Congress were visiting the border to give an update on new border legislation that was introduced last month. CBS 4's Karina Vargas joins us live from the McAllen Hidalgo International Bridge with the latest. Karina. The focus on today's visit was on the bipartisan uh, border solutions act as well as a timeline as to when restrictions will be lifted from our ports of entry. Senator John Cornyn, Arizona Senator Kirsten Sinema and U.S. Representatives Henry Cuellar and Tony Gonzalez all took part in today's tour. All four members spoke on the new legislation and what it will mean for migrant families. And the legislation aims at protecting unaccompanied migrant children and the influx of migrants along our border. Senator John Cornyn is also speaking on a transition plan to open our border. We want our border to be back open again, to legitimate trade and traffic. Uh, with the border communities depend on for the uh, for the for the for the retail businesses that operate here along the region depend on that cross border traffic uh, and the money that are spent by our friends to the south when they come over here to the communities like McAllen. Senator Cornyn is asking for the Biden administration to help. And right now, there's no timeline on when the ports will open to non-essential travel. And as far as the new legislation, Representative Cuellar says more judges will need to come to the border in order to help with the migrant influx. Working for you in Hidalgo, I'm Canina Vargas.